Hello everyone. To create a quantum reality, we need to have a connection that connects us to the infinite. And we can access the infinite supply and abundance that is in the infinite level that we are not accessing with the connection we have now. So what happens is if we want to move on into a different kind of reality, which is away from lack, limitations and crisis, we have to access uh, supernatural provision that is only available through a supernatural connection. And this is the connection with the infinite, with the quantum field. We're here to make the most of the evolutional opportunity that this life offers to all of us. And we have to connect with the supernatural level in order to create a new reality with the resources and the abundance that we are not finding here on the 3D level because those resources are not here in this level of quantity and infinity. So we need to move on to a different kind of reality and connect with that to bring it into our lives. In the universe there is no lack, there is no crisis, there are no limitations of any sort. So why are we experiencing lack and limitation if we are part of the universe? This is a big question that every human being needs to resolve and needs to find a way to understand that with a lot of uh, urgency. We cannot live a life in an infinite universe without realizing that we are not being part of that and what is happening that that infinite is not coming into our lives because we are experiencing something different. That is the key point in the quantum vision of life. In life we are connected or we are disconnected and this defines our destiny. Love is the only reality and um, the thing is once we lose the connection with love what happens is we enter into judgment. Everything that is not love is judgment and we need to understand that we want to release any perception that is less than love because that is when we come into limitations and lack. So it's moving back into the experience and the vibration of love because love is the only reality. In that sense we see that the loving messages, the loving energies that come to us are good for us. So they empower us. Everything that disempowers us is false, is illusion. Everything that empowers us is real. So we need to start defining and discerning what is telling us the truth about ourselves and what is not and uh, change our perception as to how we are managing our life. So we need to connect with love and gratitude with the universal life. So let's vibrate for a moment in this consciousness. I connect myself. Let's connect with that. I connect myself in total gratitude and love with my universal life. We want to shine in life and through that we're going to be given the best of ourselves because if we shine we are connected to the light. In the quantum reality if you are connected to the light, the light fights for you, supports you and you can live in a different way because there is a force looking after you and opening the doors for you. But if we are not connected good enough and powerfully enough with the light, then we have to fight ourselves without the support of the light. So we want to be in connection with the light because then the light fights for us. This changes completely the way we live. If we understand that the solution to the situations we have in life is not so much finding the solutions down here, but accessing a higher connection of light that is going to come in and it's going to solve, empower and make abundance and make flow everything that we're encountering here, then we can move things in connection with the infinite, in relationship with the universe, which is there for that. God is there for a reason and we are not using all the infinite power that is available to us. Humanity needs to 
take a huge step in the direction of evolution, a huge step towards the light in confidence, knowing that the reality is in the spheres of light and moving away from being deceived by the matrix, by the 3D world, which is convincing everyone now that they are in danger. It is very easy to convince humanity that something is going to happen to them uh, because we have a humanity which is disempowered, that doesn't remember who it is. People don't remember who they are. And they are allowing the matrix, allowing the 3D world to tell them who they are. Victims of a system of lack and limitation that then they have to find a solution for that because they're being victimized, they're being uh, subject to these conditions of lack and limitation. And what we need to do is to step forward and take leadership before what is happening in the world and tell the matrix, tell the 3D reality who we are. Remind yourself that you are God every day. Remind yourself that the force is with you, that everything is in your favor. And tell the 3D when it comes to you with drama or limitation, say to it, I remind you who I am. I remind you that everything is in my favor. And I remind you that I can create a wonderful reality of abundance because I am God. And God consciousness in me has the power to create the reality that I want. So we need to step up our power and move ahead into a powerful and high self-esteem, value ourselves in a new way as human beings in front of the world. This is in our relationship with the 3D reality, which is disconnected and is telling us what we need to do to be saved and what we need to be afraid of and the solutions that it's going to give us. because. We don't believe in our power and therefore we believe always in a solution that comes from outside instead of realizing that all the solutions are going to come from our connection to the infinite source of blessings and of good. So we need to believe in ourselves individually and globally in a new way. These are times of ascension, of spiritual evolution, of unity in the good sharing our love, our resources, our light to create a new humanity, a new world, a new life. We want to live um, a great life of shining our light. We want to leave a new world behind us for our children and the children of our children. And we can make an impact in the world now so that we change the world completely at this moment. In the Quantum Reality Seminars, we talk about you are not the same person when you go to bed as the same person that got up that morning. You are a different person when you go to sleep. But to do that, you have to do something. And then I tell people that what we need to do so we are a different person when we go to bed that day is to give everything from our heart, from our passion, from our soul. And if we give everything, um, the person that got up that morning is a different person when he goes to bed in the evening. And the world is a different world. So the question I want to share with you is, what are you doing every day to become a different person, to become a quantum being that has made an impact in the world? And when he or she goes to bed, the world is different because of the impact and the light you share with the world. Are you living in that way? And that is crucial because we need to be moving into the direction of making such an impact every day in life and in the world that the world is different every day because we have that shining light to put into it and to share with everyone else. Humanity, as I say, needs to take a step, needs to make a decision about uh, going into the higher connections to bring a new life of goodness and blessings to the individual and the collective sphere of reality. But too many people are being um, a victim of doubt. Sometimes they just doubt everything. People are not taking a step towards creating a new life of evolution, connecting with something else, finding someone or a method that can connect them to the infinite 
in a powerful way so they can bring that into their lives and um, humanity needs to move away from this doubt from this fear so we can create a reality of blessings and um, of uh, empowerment that we can all share and we can all live because it is necessary that we create a different world so are we gonna do that every day are we gonna shine our light are we gonna tell the 3d who we are telling the world I remind you that I am God I remind you that I have the power to create my reality and I'm not gonna be doubting because of the um, scenarios of lack or limitation the matrix want to show me I'm gonna be confident I'm gonna remember that all the power is with me and that if I am vibrating in alignment with love with light with prosperity all the good things are gonna come to me and I don't have to worry about what is going on in the matrix um, or in the 3d world of limitations because I am connected to the abundance everywhere there is prosperity everywhere there is abundance I'm surrounded here by a fabulous abundance and everywhere I am there is only abundance everywhere I just need to realize that I have to shift my perception as a human being to be able to see that there is there is abundance everywhere that the abundance is with me that the universe is in my favor and there is nothing that you need to worry about because the infinite provision is there always for you whatever situation you are living in and you just have to open up and receive that abundance is not a thing of curriculum it is an issue of invitation you want to invite abundance into your life it's an issue of love that you want to love the infinite abundance that is there available to you and to everyone and through your love that abundance is going to come to you in a new way that you're not experiencing now or not experiencing very often but that invitation is going to allow it to come into you and show up in your life through you in all areas of your life we're talking here about financial but not only that also health abundance and prosperity in your health in your relationships in your spirituality your experience of a spiritual connection your experience of inner peace every day in your profession abundance and prosperity in your profession and in your life mission in a way that when you change your perception to see that there is no lack anywhere there is only abundance everywhere then all that is an invitation for that infinite abundance which is there to come into you and bless all the areas of your life so I want you to make a commitment with me here today that you're gonna shine your light in a powerful way every day in a new way that is gonna touch the people that are with you and it's gonna change the world in a new way in a better way that is gonna happen because you decided to shine your light that day are you gonna go to bed leaving the world a better place because you made an impact of light because you decided to shine you're here I'm here to shine and we are gonna shine together from now on and this is the opportunity we have to move into an evolutional uh, direction for all of us in humanity and inspire others to do that if I can inspire a thousand people with this message and those people can inspire another thousand people we can change humanity and we can change the world today we only need one day to change the whole of humanity by sharing love and shining who we are and I want to invite you to do that from this moment on to give everything every day so when you go to bed you're a different person to the one who woke up that morning because in giving everything you transform yourself into a greater person 
into a more expanded awareness and more light went into you that day and tomorrow you do the same and you become another person who is shining that light and blessing everyone and changing the world so i want to invite you to live in this way from now on and make a decision don't allow doubt to stop you to put a hole on the good things that you can achieve in your life because if your life was going to end tomorrow you would probably think i didn't give everything i didn't give myself every opportunity to find a new connection to shine my light more to do things that i could do but i didn't do them because i doubted find a way to connect more invest your resources invest uh, everything that you have available to you so that you can feel good about you about the time that you're spending here or you're fulfilling your mission don't pay attention to what the 3d world is saying concentrate in your evolution in what you can do to become that person that shines his or her light so we are here to do that and we want to do that so let's experience this commitment to the light you cannot create a new start but we can create a new destiny